Hello everyone, what is up? Um, this will be the first tutorial in the series of uh, multiplayer Demon Clash. Uh, the other two series got deleted from YouTube. The first one that I could not find the code and the second one didn't turn out so well. So basically what I'm going to do in this series is try to make a multiplayer game based on how I made my multiplayer game instead of a totally different game and flash itself does not have multiplayer so what we'll be using is a software that has its own you can say api to use multiplayer and we will do that by well the software itself is smart box paper so we can do all that smartboxsilver.com uh, and this is how it will probably look around the time I download this and um, uh, you can read up about all these things to see what it's about but we just have to go to the download page or just hover it and choose which one um, we would want to download Smartbox Pro because well, if you read up the differences in the products, you see how base it has Pro and Two Thousand, and uh, I think all of it to download is free, so just. Um, Smartbox Silver Pro, click on it, and I download. And you can download it for whatever operating system you have. I have Windows 32 bit, so I'll download it for that. Uh, I'm not sure it has, if it has 64 bit, but you might have to contact them yourself. Download it. SFS Pro. It takes a while to download because it, a lot of megabytes are according to your internet. And um, these are all the different updates which shows you. Uh, there's a Flash API, there's a Free Unity, iOS, Java. And you can read about the updates. Let's start first. So that's on free unity. But when you download the API itself, there's examples inside the API that you want to use with Flash. So I'll just unpause this video when it's finished downloading. Alright, so there's three to two minutes left and it's still ranging. And I just want to talk about what we're going to be making. Inside the downloads folder, there are many examples that show you what you can make. And you can also go to Smart Box Silver. No, don't click on it. Just don't do that part. Just click on it and go to the documentation. Uh, this will go to Redbox Overview, but we want to go to 5SFS Basic Tutorials. Just click on that, and all these things will show you and explain to you how Smartbox Over works. Because I did not have any YouTube videos to help me with this, so I use documentation. These things are really helpful, and this is what made me understand it. And these things are based on the examples in the folder itself that you will see. Uh, after we are finished, or well, you are finished with these things, but I will be going through this with you, you can go to Smartbox Over Pro, which will deal with extensions and all these things, but databases, and all those things you, you might need. And you can 
people to check out his pro tutorial uh, that show you all different things and you can just explore all these different things. But I'm basic super connection, this is how it shows you to connect to a super. You begin this in the next video, but you can just read up on these things to get an understanding of it and these documents will explain to you what this is about. And that's what I wanted to explain so you can get more facts over documentation. And now it's almost finished downloading. So we just need to wait. Okay. It is complete. It's open. Uh, I think you need to install it. So you can read those terms of agreements which I did already. So you can select your destination folder which I will go to the program files. I'll get to it in a moment. And install. So, we wait for that to install. One thing you need to know though. Do not ever try to format your phone using Control Shift F or clicking the format button in the Action Scripts panel because Smartbox Server runs a different type of syntax, I can say. And whenever you format your code, it kind of messes up with the syntax. So. If you say if one is equal to one, then trace hello, and we press the format button that will usually format format the code to suit a meeting of needs. But Smartbox Server has its own syntax. And if you press the format, then this might appear down here with something like that. But this might appear up here, this will appear up here. That messes up the entire code. So uh, I have been doing well, just don't do that. So it's almost finished installing. I'll go to open up. We are going to use one of the examples as our base to start off the making our multiplayer game. Because starting from scratch takes too long. So it's completed. Just close and we'll go into program files. So you just need to go wherever you save this. I save it in the computer, local disk D, this program files. What program? Local disk D. Program files. And that saves it as. So in this, you, well, this is the batch file you use to open the server or start the server. 
and these are the cash APIs but this is the example we want to check so green examples you can use whatever you want but I use action script too and these these are just a list of games that you can open up in flash and look around to see how it is used simple connect will show you the one we are going to use for multiplayer games is avatar chat because that includes making different avatars join on stage and talk with each other and that's what I built off my game from. So I just start the server here and while that's loading because it takes a while to load I'll just go into avatar chat and click on the shuffle flash file and that will open the game. So you can Okay, so it's super bomb sad. You can go in any of those examples and check out the games. Oh, super shut down. Probably have one to close down, so let's try to do. Oh, access is denied. Oh well, that's probably just because I have a server already. It should not say access denied for me. Because look, I have a flat up server downloaded already. Let's try this one. Not think that we got it. Well, we'll look into that next time, but for now, thanks again and I'll see you.